Then I'ma swap it out. Jada sneaker guy, 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 Jada sneaker guy. You tube, damn ugly. What is going on today with everyone, man? Hey, welcome back and welcome to all the newcomers, man. It is your boy, Jada sneaker guy. Hitting y'all up today with yet another early look, review, on feet, lay swap, all the good stuff, man. Yes, man, today we do have the Air Jordan 6 Tech Chrome. Oh, bro, I, I messed that all the way up. Is it Chrome? Might be Chrome by itself. I know of it as Smoke Gray, but yes, it is a women's exclusive, but uh, just, just remove the women's. But yes, these are dope in my opinion, man. Very, very, you know, it, it has a manly colorway to it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why they didn't make this, you know, a full family sizing or really just a man's exclusive. The only thing that I think that they put on there to kind of give it a women's twist is the patent leather, which is a killer to most people, man. That patent leather hit on the side makes people like, hey, man, they killed it with the patent leather, you know what I'm saying? But for me, I mean, I was telling myself that I have to see them in hand in order to make my decision on them. And upon seeing them in hand, like, the patent leather is a deal breaker, but it's not as bad as, as what a picture made it. Because if you know, when you take pictures of something, especially that patent leather, it's gonna shine. So you'll see more of that, that glossy type bright look on it through pictures. But when you see them on feet, you know what I'm saying, they, they, they tone well, it's toned down a little bit more than what you would see in a pic because it's not like that shiny, if you understand what I'm saying. But they should have left it off, man. But, you know, that is what it is. But we do have them here today, man. These are set to release. Um, Is it Thursday? I believe it's Thursday. I know the date is September 24th. I'm not too sure if that's a Thursday or a Friday. I want to say it's a Thursday, but um, that's nothing you know that that we haven't seen under the sun already we we've seen all well pretty much mostly all of the women's exclusive release shoes released during the week they don't really normally release them on weekends like you know like we get regular you know jordan releases but enough of the yeah, yep yeah man if this is your first time stopping through checking out any of the family's content or you are a returning visitor man go ahead and join the family y'all by hitting that subscribe button man we are on the road to 50k and it would be greatly appreciated man if y'all jump the board man y'all will not be disappointed a lot of things going on over here man but yes man in advance welcome to the family man but all that talking y'all still ain't seen the shoe well y'all have seen the shoes they right there man but let me give y'all a close-up of them things real quick man Oof. bang yes sir we got the air jordan 6 Chrome or smoke grays. Got them joints right here, man. As you can see, we got this big old Jordan jump, man. Uh, hang tag on it. And then, like I was telling y'all, man, we got those hits of that patent leather, which we will get into during the review, man. But real quick, 360 look at the shoes before we dive into the review of them, man. But um, that is your Jordan 6s chrome or smoke grays and um let's go ahead and talk about them man Bang! starting with the box y'all we get our regular air jordan 6 slash jordan 5 box man nothing different on this one same exact thing everywhere taking a look at the size tag that we get on this one y'all it reads women's air jordan 6 retro this is a u.s 10 women's which is equivalent to a men's eight and a half um i couldn't get a nine and a half to get that nine so i just took the eight and a half which will work but um the color blocking on this one is black what does that say black chrome light smoke gray so hence why we got that chrome and smoke gray you know name but that is your size tag man take a look at it real quick pause it if you need to but um taking a look at the inside of the box man 
box lid does have a lot number right there as well as a quality control sticker inside there and um we also get a white and green sticker so all three of those things your black trash can paper that comes with these and that is it for the box man let's jump back into the kicks y'all bang again fix that bang but uh yes man these do come with an extra set of two laces y'all um one already standard laces but as i said an extra set of two laces those are oh there we go you got your like a, a bluish what color it's like a it's like a almost like a light blue sky blue not really a sky blue but just a light blue as well as a gray so we get gray and blue black standard lace man so no extra laces other than those three come with the shoe and that's how your laces should look they're not in no type of neatly fashioned or away or anything they just they thrown in there man but that is your laces man let's go ahead and jump into the review man starting with the outsole regular air jordan 6 outsole however man this does have a cell outsole so we got hits of cell got that translucent translucent icy bottom hit right there as well as that blue jump man so that is your outsole moving up to the midsole starting with this air system y'all if you take a look right here into the air system we can get some more light we do got a blue that same blue that we have right there on that that um lace lock same blue and as well as the same blue that we have with the laces we have inside of the air system y'all so that is your air system moving on from that take a look at this midsole again it is a cell midsole we got black hits as well as that translucent hit that comes up that milky you know what i'm saying hit from the bottom that comes up on it but this is cell it is not a pure white hence to why you can possibly throw some cell laces in here you know what i'm saying it'll probably make it look probably make it look all right but yes you got cell moving up above that we do get hits of what is i'm thinking that they're calling the smoke gray because um you know you got that light grayish color. i mean both of them could be smoke gray you can have dark smoke or light smoke but yes you do got that hit of gray and it does have suede man it is a furry suede on that area pretty much furry suede all throughout the shoe man just different colors of gray but as i said man we do have hits of this patent leather this clear like patent leather um hit right here and it does have your holes in it just like your regular jordan 6 does but it does have the tongue like you know how you got your inner liner on the inside of the shoe that that holds it down as far as like the the elastic area so that your your tongue won't come out that is what you can see straight through that patent leather area man so you got that right there man which is what a lot of people are saying that they hate about this shoe but it's not bad in my opinion especially when you have them on feet but um taking a look at the back half you do get a different color contrast of that gray this is more of a darker gray on your back half but um this is a hard normally on sixes the recent sixes this has been kind of soft but this is more of a hard bubble right here that we have on the back but that is how that area looks back there man moving on to the back of the shoe we do get that jump man that is in a lighter gray color and we get a translucent clear like a milky um pull tab right here on the back man we got a a what is this like a what, what you call that man a satin you got like a satin interior man around your around your sock liner satin material you know i guess it's giving it subtle women's touches on it you know what i'm saying but um if we take a look at the front of the shoe y'all we get black laces as i said that come factory laced we get that light gray jump man right there on that that lace tab and then on the lace lock we get a clear lace lock with a blue jump man on that man and i did tell y'all earlier we do get this hang tag of a chrome jump man which i it's a little too big for me to be wearing on my shoe so i'll take that off when i'm wearing them taking a look at the tongue we got that smoke gray tongue reads air jordan regular six style tongue on these um moving on shoe tree y'all we got eight through eight and a half half size on the shoe tree and that is how that looks it does say die cut sock liner right there on the inside as you can see so die cut sock liner is what's written and i can see you know my recycling i can see my eight and a half you, you that's exactly how it's supposed to look y'all so that is your shoe tree we take a look at the inside y'all get some more light real quick 
All right, taking a look at the inside. We got Nike Air, which is written in cell. That is not white, it's written in cell. You got your black insole on there. Everything else on the inside is black. See if we can get a quick look at, do we got any lace tips? Nah, nothing on the lace tips, but take a quick look at this size tag. We got April through June, man. So two month production on these shoes as you can take a look right there at that size tag man so if y'all want to pause that for a second check it out that is your sizing tag on them and yes man that will pretty much do it y'all for the review of the air jordan 6 chrome or smoke grays man these are set to release as i said september 24th retail price a hundred and ninety dollars man you did get that premium price tag even though it's a women's exclusive but they not bad man on um, the rating i would give this shoe bro i would give it a i give it a i give it an eight and a half man i give this an eight and a half bro the only thing in my eyes that makes this a women's shoe is that patent leather hit man other than that this is a very like masculine like it looks like a man's shoe the colorway of it and everything looks like a man's shoe bro so i see what you know dudes can pull this off such as myself you know what i'm saying because I don't, I don't worry about what nobody be saying about what I would, you know what I'm saying? If I buy it and I rock it, I'm comfortable with my sex. Good, man. But, uh, yeah, if y'all want to go after them, go ahead and get y'all a pair, man. Like I said, they look very, you know, they look they look masculine, man. I, I'll be surprised. I won't be surprised if, if a lot of women get steered away from it because of just, you know, the manly look that the shoe has, man. Even my wife, she said these look like a, a man's shoe. But, um, yeah, man, I give them a, a eight and a half, bro. I would give it a higher grade, bro. If, if this was just black it didn't have that patent leather on it just based off the colorway man this would be a this would be like a nine nine and a half man like it's, it's dope in my opinion man you could do a lot with this shoe and i like the sale i like that they use sale instead of white man so very dope shoe in my opinion man um let me know if y'all are going after them we're gonna throw them on feet real quick and um wrap up the video man thank y'all for rocking out more early reviews to come y'all stay blessed until the next one your boy jay sneak guys checking out with the air jordan six chrome smoke grades hey whatever it is man we gone to the next one man y'all stay blessed peace
say this nigga Got the people's eye, yeah Got the people's eye, yeah